Oh, December Ipsy is here. I'm shookity shocked. It is the 28th. They did send this over in PR for me to unbox for you all. I know. She's a beaut. She's a beaut. Timo. <laughs> Anyways, before we jump into today's unboxing, I do want to talk about my lips. Uh, I have a PR unboxing coming up. I've actually unboxed these before, but Hard Candy sent them over again with their lip plumper. Now, you don't have to use their lip plumper gloss with this, but these have a little bit of a tingle plump to them. Super soft, super hydrating, super amazing because they're like six bucks a piece. So I think there's like six different shades. So here's the two that I mixed today. So I mixed both of these. I'll link them for you guys. Um, maybe they'll pop up here from YouTube, but they're available at Walmart, like I said, for about six bucks a piece. These will make amazing stocking stuffers. I know a lot of you guys have been saying, Rhonda, can you give us ideas for stocking stuffers? Here's some. Here's some. <laughs> <laughs> and of course the subscription box so anyways if you're new to the channel welcome my name is Ron and over here we embrace the hot mess it is a judgment free drama free stress free zone where today we are unboxing our ipsy glam bag for December FYI Haley and I did film the November ipsy versus ipsy I just have to edit that uh, and get that up I was actually having like I was still getting over being sick and then I was <laughs> having irritation to my eye it was a whole situation and plus we were like bouncing off walls so i am a um, fun fact about me when it comes to editing i'm not a huge fan of it but i have to do it anyways and then i have the boxy charm by ipsy now i will have a link an affiliate link down in my description box for you guys if you do want to go ahead and sign up for either one of these boxes they are both monthly subscriptions this one i think is about i think after tax it's probably going to run close to like $34 I think because they did you guys told me they they charged like a dollar more or something and then there's a handling fee and then this I think is gonna go up to like maybe $17 I don't know so before we jump into today's unboxing welcome to the ramble fest okay go ahead whoever wants to leave a comment let me know when or everyone know when the unboxing starts the sass and the PMS is real anyways a huge shout out and thank you to my YouTube members thank you guys so so much for helping to support the channel you don't have to but you choose to every single month and I appreciate each and every single one of you if membership is not your forte that's okay and you still want to tip or donate the channel YouTube has implemented this new thing called thanks all you got to do is click that button and you can tip and donate to your creator and thank you to those of you that have done that you guys are just so sweet and to those of you that are returning constantly watching sharing my videos over on Facebook can I just say thank you I, I know I talk about it but I just feel like I need to talk about it all the time because without you all my channels would not be successful and I wouldn't be where I'm at without you all and I just don't want you all to think I forget about that because you all are the reason I am here let's go ahead and start with the ipsy glam bag I you know I just love the packaging I love that they've changed it up ipsy has always been like pink for so long yes I will try and remember to link this ring <laughs> oh, okay I'm so sorry I'm gonna left hand turn it uh, I have to un or I have to edit the video go figure uh, where I unbox this but I said over there it reminds me of mama tot's beautiful diamond ring that she wears this is just it's two two pieces I love 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 so it was funny because I, I get, you guys know, I get the Timu wedding sets all the time. And when I travel like with Haley or whatever, when we've gone down to Florida, I just wear a gold band. I don't like to wear my actual wedding set. I have so much anxiety and fear. And we're gonna be traveling here shortly too. And I'm like, I think I'm gonna just wear this versus my actual diamonds because the world's a crazy place and it makes me scared. So I would rather somebody snag this from me than my actual ring. You know what I mean? Like, I don't care if there's insurance on it. I, I just don't think I want to take that chance. You know? My husband's like, you do whatever you want, honey. And I'm like, I don't know. Okay, so when it comes to the Ipsy Glam Bag, I know, I'm all over the place. Mind your business. There was a full moon last night and your girl is working on like little to no sleep. It was, what is that? Oh, it's a cute little ball. Oh, it's a glittery little. This reminds me of like a summer mermaid Barbie-esque-ness. But I see where they're going with the holiday, you know? 
I, I mean, you all know, your girl loves glitter, shimmer, and all things sparkle. Did I even finish the sentence? My husband just got me a big juicy salad. So my brain's braining again, but maybe a little too much. I don't know. But yeah, that full moon was something fierce. I mean, I was like, what is going on? Like, literally the night before, I had over nine hours of sleep. My body loves sleep. Like, me and sleep are like this, normally. It was awful. Anyways, when it comes to the glam bag, you do get to customize one item in your bag. They're typically deluxe size samples. And the nice thing I feel like with them is they're travel size. They're going to get you through TSA. They're going to get you enough item and product to figure out whether or not it's your forte. Now, because, because this was set in PR, I did not customize anything. So the first item in here, oh, it's a, I love this. Okay, so it's a nice little brush it's from dome or it's dome blending by sheena b cosmetics and i like this because i have slightly hooded lids so if it's too floofy of a brush it's hard for me to like get up in there but this is going to be a really good crease brush i like that a lot of the times i just gift them away but this is a keeper i like that sorry guys i'm being stingy all right so the first thing i see is the shades by Shan Gel Eyeliner. Ooh, it's in Sweet Caramel. You know, this is nice because it's not in black, and I feel like a lot of the times, that's what I'm getting. Sorry, I'm watching my child. <laughs> so, I know a lot of you guys were like, hey, Rana, can you film you doing your gel nails? And if you guys haven't been with me for a while, I was sick with the flu, um, like the first week or so of November. It was not fun. And anyways, I filmed it, <laughs> but I sound horrible in it, and so I scrapped the whole video. So I'm gonna have to like redo it, cause I literally, like, I hardly had a voice at all. It was something, Oh, this is gorgeous. Not only the shade, but the way it feels. It just feels like it's gonna glide right on there. Hold on, let me stalk my child. Okay, so I like that. So, I mean, that's really nice. Now, uh, granted, you may not see everything in this bag because you're going to customize your item but these are potential items that you will see oh i got a little card in here our next mega drop shop is coming in hot january 8th to the 21st all right next in here oh my gosh we have what's up beauty if you've never heard of what's up beauty uh once again the pr unboxing is coming i think in a few days actually and oh my gosh this is beautiful i love the shades What's Up Beauty had actually sent over their new eyeshadow palette and their new highlighters. Their formula is made in Italy and it is absolutely gorgeous and stunning. Their shimmers, their shifts, they're so beautiful and they're so easy to work with. And oh my gosh, they could not have put together a better duo for this. I love that they're actual shades that I could see myself wearing. These are so pretty. They're very buildable. So even though I did like a nice little tiny swatch, this is a very, very, very buildable. And if you do more of like a tap versus a rubbing, you're really gonna be able, kind of like my topper in my eyeshadow palette, Sweet and Sciacy, if you like tap the shade more than rubbing the shade, you're gonna get a better payoff. And that's how it is with that. You guys see that? It is just such a stunning, beautiful formula. Uh, this is in Plumore. Probably said that incorrectly. I don't think we're shocked. I don't think we're surprised. Okay, next in here, we've got the Havana, however you say it, Extreme Radiance Light Lifting. No, Lifting Mask. This is for firming. Okay, that's nice. And then last, we have the Dr. Brandt. Oh my gosh, this is so sending me back. Sorry if I have salad in my teeth, but we're friends here, okay? Um, but yeah, this is the Dr. Brandt Microdermabrasion. Do you guys remember? I used to be obsessed with this formula. Like BoxyCharm had it in the big one in their box like 2018, 2019. Freaking geeked. Love, love, love. I love that. And then Kate Somerville came in. But either way, it's, it's really good. I think you're going to like it. Okay, it's going to be a long video. <laughs> okay, let's go ahead and unbox our BoxyCharm by Ipsy. I don't know what that was. Can I just say this feels like it's like potentially packaged really well, which would make my heart happy. Let's, let's open it together. 
okay well you know here's one thing i do appreciate is the fact that i feel like creators don't typically get the the little doodad you know like when it's set in pr which i get like don't spend all your money on us whatever but i i do like to get it just so i can maybe kind of show you guys things like december has the hand picked power picks so you're gonna see things like the jlo beauty is in here who are these eyeshadow palettes from we got the JLo Beauty That Hit Single Gel Cream Cleanser, the Ciate London Extraordinary Brightening Under Eye Perfector, the Il Maquillage Color Boss Squad Eyeshadow Palette. Uh, we've also got things like the JLo Beauty That Fresh Take Eye Cream, Ciate London Vitamin Boost, Viro Pro Berry or Refining Toner, the REM Beauty Midnight Shadows Palette. That's what I was curious about. Rhonda, if you had just read right there, REM Beauty. You know, y'all should just be proud that I was actually reading that. Normally, I just throw it off to the side. Um, then there's this other set day, whatever, and it's a hyaluronic acid renewal serum retinol. $68. So this is all going to be power picks. Y'all know, I still don't understand the power picks. I think that's kind of what took over. And I know Tina. I know a lot of Jen. I think you guys have always been in my comment section trying to break it down for your girl, but you all know. You all know how your girl is. Like in one ear and out the other, and then I'm just like, I got it. Gone like a fart in the wind. Forget it the next time. Let's be honest. I'll, I'll keep it real with y'all. So anyways, let's move on. Okay, so my packaging actually was wrapped like a miniature little hug. So a little bit better. There's a lot of stuff in here. What's going on? Okay, so this. It's not something that you would, I don't think, get. I think this is because it was set in PR. And it's floofy, fluffy, pink, mother flippin' socks. My sensories are in overload right now because I love, yes, I love these kind of socks. Oh my gosh. They're like, okay, not all fuzzy socks are made the same. I don't care what you say. They are not made the same. And this is like the nicest, like wrap you in a hug kind of blanket. Let's see. Oh yeah. Anybody else funny about how their sock stretches around their ankle? It's gotta just be a certain way. If it's tight, I'm like, Ugh. yes. Oh, this makes me so happy. And it's pink. I love, love, love. Okay, next in here, we've got the TYS Beauty Final Treat Hyaluronic Acid Infused Setting Spray. Can I just tell y'all, I just picked up the Beekman 1802. Uh, it's like a toner, hyaluronic spray, whatever. My skin has been so happy, like so flippin' happy. I It was like for a Black Friday deal and everything. I actually picked up a travel size. So when we are like traveling or whatever, I can freaking spray my face down because I, I don't know what happens, but it's like, I'm like raisin. So I got that. So I'm excited for this one too, the Hyaluronic Acid Infused Setting Spray. I just feel like this would be just so beneficial especially why are you smelling it it's a setting spray it has no scent but in the mister oh she's a good one i think my eyes just went cross-eyed i had somebody tell me i had a tumor because my eyes went cross-eyed i'm like dude i i i just do that like ah you know what i mean that scared me like i literally was like running to the the mirror checking my eyeballs and i'm like it's a false alarm y'all just making stuff up in the comment section okay so next in here this i guess it's a lip scrub okay so i thought well maybe it's tiny it would go in the other one but no Ooh, it said it it's sweet vanilla Ooh. i just had a salad and i chopped up onions i swear i washed my hands but we all know how onions are so it was like a sweet vanilla slash onion scent Welcome to the channel if you're new here. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh, I want to eat that. Don't do that, kids. Don't do that. I am really bad. Like, there's times I swear my 23-year-old has to parent me. Because I'm like, oh my gosh, Haley, that smells so good. I want to lick it. She's like, mom, it's makeup. You can't do that. I'm like, mm. I'm excited about that. That is going straight to my shower. 
Next in here, we've got Vitamin Boost Plumping Primer by Ciate London. I'm excited to try this out. I haven't tried one of their primers since the Watermelon Burst Primer, and I really like that. Actually, I have their uh, Watermelon Setting Spray on. I love Ciate London's products. Like for a while there, we always got the Ciate London Mascara, and I'm kind of like Syed. I'm ready for some more. Next in here, we have the Dermalectic or Dermalect Flawless Truly Treatment. I'm gonna put this one in a giveaway because for whatever reason, the book, book whatever, this stuff right here, book truly, however you say it, I know it's like a natural, I think, plant-based type of retinol thingy, but my skin can't really handle it. Like, I feel like on some formulas it can, but on others, it lights me up. So I'm not even gonna, cause I finally have my skin in a place that we're both very happy. Uh, so I'm gonna just set this aside, but this is a potential choice that you may see. Next in here, we have the REM Beauty Palette. Oh, please don't be broken. It did come shipped in this box. Oh, please don't be broken. I've never tried REM Beauty Shadows. Okay, so it's in like a plasticky kind of case. Very um, spacey. Like, I don't know what you'd call it. Okay. Oh, don't know why I'm smelling it. Okay, my first thoughts is this is a nice, pretty, everyday palette. I, I mean, it's very wearable. It's very safe. And I mean, I guess, I don't know. I actually like it. Are we, sh are we shocked? <laughs> no. Uh, yeah, I actually like these shades. And I know the swatches don't tell the full story, but I will say they did feel really nice. Oh, yeah. I'm barely pressing. Yes, I used my thumb to swap. This is a nice formula, guys. Now, here's one thing that I think I've learned off of TikTok is the founder, I thought, of REM Beauty is just absolutely so in love and so, I wish I was better at articulating the, the words, like, from brain to mouth but so passionate when it comes to her brand now maybe I have the owner incorrect and I, if that's the case I'm so sorry um, but I'm pretty sure I, I follow you or, or you came across my TikTok, and I just loved everything she stood for but like I said if I love Jesus but like I said even if I have the brand in or wrong I'm, I'm I apologize but I really like the formula of this so this is definitely one where it's a travel friendly type of compact case it does have a mirror in here and like I said it's futuristic it's very futuristic to me the way the case is it's not gonna be a easy to stack that's got to be your tippy top but I don't know I like it and then last in here I think this is also like a PR type of dealio um, the Ipsy Creator. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. Okay, so maybe, I don't know, I think this is just something they just put in PR. But this is a cute little water bottle strap holder. So I like that. I like that a lot. Because you guys know in the summertime, we are always out and about. So this would be great to hold your water bottle, your Stanley Cup, whatever. So thank you so much, Ipsy. Okay, so I'm not even gonna fib, you guys. Uh, Ipsy did, did good. Okay, I'm thank you for the palette not being broken because I do get excited to try new makeup and I am so excited to try this palette out. The palette name, if you are curious, it's the shade Baby Doll. So if this ends up being one of your choices and you like kind of more of like a neutral warm eyeshadow palette, I think you might really like this one, y'all. I really do. I think it's really pretty. And if you have my palette sweet and sassy the topper with that and then oh you go with kisses from kentucky which is my highlighter just for some added bonus of shimmer yeah i think that would be beautiful so thank you so much to ipsy for sending this over my way i'm going to do my best to hurry up and get this edited for y'all 
get it up tonight which is the 28th of november so don't forget when it comes to our ipsy choices those are actually coming up to make your picks um as far as the actual day i always am just like good to go and ready like by the first but i think they switched it to the second so if you guys can remember because you know my my brain oh <laughs> uh, yeah just gone like a fart in the wind like i said but i want to say it's like the first to the third is when you can start making your picks maybe the second to the third i gotta let us know i know somebody's gotta know we're all friends here Chitty chat chat. All right, friends. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. And if you want to sign up for the December box, get ready for, you know, the future icon boxes. Because I'm telling you what, the Pat McGrath icon box that we just had was freaking amazing. Uh, that is quarterly, by the way. But if you want to sign up for Ipsy, any of their bags or boxes, I'm going to have an affiliate link down below. Thank you guys so, so much if you do choose to click my link and sign up using it. I definitely appreciate it. It does earn me a little bit of a commission. I will have other things linked down below for you guys, such as my collection with Ofra, which may still be on sale. And if it's not, if you are watching this video later and it's no longer on sale, don't worry, code Hot Mess will save you 20%. Check out my girl Jotty's collection over there with Project Influencer. Hey, we are all about community and supporting each other, and you, you guys should support my girl too. She is pretty dog. I was talking so much, my camera was like, you're done. Guess what, I'm not. So anyways, I will also link the hard candy, the little lip balms down there. Oh, I'll link the Timu ring as well. So thank you guys so, so much for watching. Shout out once again. To my YouTube members, I appreciate you guys so, so much. Thank you to those of you clicking the thanks button. Check me out on my other channels, Hot Mess Mama Vlogs for Curvy Girl Fashion Hauls over there, Hot Mess in the Kitchen. I'm on TikTok and Instagram, at Hot Mess Mama of Four. And until next time, as always, kisses from Kentucky. Bye. But this is my favorite holiday It's a chance to start over new Cause I missed you so I'm letting go of everything but you